Hello everybody. So I got this Lego set a couple of days ago. Let's uh, build it up and play with it a little bit. So after the set is built up, uh, we have this little setting. It is a hallway. And uh, this actually comes from a scene from uh, the show, The Mandalorian. It's the season two finale. And we have four minifigures. So the first minifigure we have is going to be Luke Skywalker uh, with his uh, green lightsaber. And then we also have three of these dark troopers right here. Uh, this one is not wearing his helmet, so we can see he's an android. Uh, but if we also put his buddies next to him, we're going to see that they're wearing their helmets. So we'll put one up here. And they also hold their little, uh, or their big weapons, uh, looks kind of like a rifle, double-barrel rifle actually. So let's uh, put them into this scene. So here uh, we have Luke Skywalker right here, and he's fighting off these three troopers, dark troopers. I put one behind right here. Um, so we have two play features on this little Lego set here. One is you can see Luke is standing on a little turn table so you can turn him and you know as he carries his little lightsaber he can strike one of the dark troopers like so. It takes a little bit of imagination but you can imagine that he's swinging his lightsaber right at this dark trooper right here. The second play feature is that uh, there's a lever right here, all the way down here, and you can bring this dark trooper forward or pull him backwards. And so this kind of mimics Luke's using the force. He can either either use the force to pull the trooper towards him or away from him. And one last thing we could do is we could actually put Luke on this little lever here or the slide and we could actually have him kind of rush toward the trooper like that. Still takes a little bit of imagination but I give Lego a little bit of credit for putting these little play features here. It makes the scene a little bit more interesting. This little turn turning action right here is actually I think an evolution of something that Lego tried to be or has been trying to be do in the past couple of years. So this set uh, is called the Dark Trooper Attack. And the Dark Trooper Attack is this box right here. And this turning play feature is kind of an evolution of something that came about, I think started in the year 2019. So I'll show you a set from 2019 that I have that has a feature that's very similar. And so let's take away Luke Skywalker's. And so this set from 2019 was called the Duel on Star Killer Base. And it had uh, Kylo Ren versus Rey. So let's put it right here. And so both of these guys were actually on little turntables and there's Kylo Ren, there's Rey, and basically you turn, kind of swing the lightsabers against each other, like so. And I think actually the one for Luke Skywalker, the one that came out uh, two months ago about, the Dark Trooper attack, kind of improved on this because in this one, it's kind of hard to turn these two, or at least it's kind of easy but kind of awkward. Uh, but with Luke Skywalker, as you'll see in about two seconds, let me bring him back. So here's Luke Skywalker, the turning function, this little kind of like a switch over here, so it's easier to turn him. So they improved on it a little bit, so way to go Lego. <laughs> so yeah, this is the Dark Trooper attack. Uh, from Lego and for May the 4th, Star Wars Day, just want to say happy Star Wars Day to everybody out there and may the force be with you. 
Oh, and just one last thing, my uh, little clone troopers here, my clone trooper squad would like to uh, give a shout out to those in Ukraine. Stay strong, guys. And that should be it for me today. Yeah, so my clone troopers in uh, blue and yellow, uh, hoping the best for everybody out there. Let's bring Luke Skywalker back. And once again, thanks for watching this video. I hope it entertained you a little bit. If it did, please uh, consider giving me a thumbs up. And I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.